Okay, we're going to show you the fastest and easiest way to create a new web community with the new launch form software. So let's jump right in immediately. We'll log into our admin account with Facebook. And we're in. The first thing we're going to want to do is go into site settings and change the name of this forum. Uh, this one's going to be about movies. It's called Casting Redos, uh, a movie community. So let's just save that. Exit out of Bitmain. And now immediately let's customize the template. We're going to want to change our logo and our background colors. So we'll go into page settings or what we call change it where you see it. All these wrenches indicate areas on the page where there's something you can change, including the logo. So let's do that now. You'll select our new logo and save. And we will select a blue color that we like for the background. And we'll save that as well. So now we have our template looking pretty good, but we want to add some more content. So let's go ahead and, uh, and add a new content box. And here we're going to showcase the number one movie right now. So let's edit our new content box and we'll say number one movie. And that just so happens last week at least to be Battle Los Angeles. So we'll just put the address to the YouTube trailer for that movie and click save and launch form will automatically suck in that video and display it for us. So now we've got our logo, our background and some featured content. Now this particular community, let's say that we're going to be about making money and uh, we want to do that with ads. So let's go ahead and set up some ads right off the bat. And in change it where you see it mode, the ad locations will be revealed. So we'll just jump over and I have some uh, snippet code from Google AdSense program that will display ads. So we'll just save that in there. And once it's saved, we're going to add a, another larger ad down here. We'll do this with a new content box. New content box is created. So we'll edit that. And we'll just jump back over here again and get some more Google AdSense snippet code. Save that in there and save now. And our ad should be displayed. So now we've got our logo, our background, our ad customization, and some featured content. Actually, we can reorder and move that up if we'd like to keep the movie trailer at the top. Okay, so what next? Every forum needs to have some categories and some subforums. So right now we just have private messages and watch topics. Let's go into admin mode again, add a new category, and we'll call this just generally casting reduce. And now that we have that category created, we'll just uh, go down and we'll click to add a new form and we'll call this just in general reviews. So we're good. We've got one category set up and one some form called reviews. Let's go out of admin mode and jump right into that reviews form. And wasting no time, we'll create our first new topic and we'll say source code. Maybe, maybe source code was uh, Jake the right choice um, and we'll, we'll type something what are some better actor choices for source code and since we love media we might as well go over and grab the the address to the trailer for source code and we'll attach a video here entering the address and that movie will then be placed into the photo or video gallery so we'll post the topic. Topic is now posted. Let's just take a quick look. Here's the thumbnail, but we want to see if the video is being displayed. And it is. It's good to go in the gallery. So real quickly, as admins, we like to feature this on the home page. So let's go down and make a feature. Get confirmation that that has been done. And then we'll jump on over to home just to verify. So that's about it. We've pretty quickly set up a nice movie forum and we'll say, hey, we love movies. Welcome to our forum. We view the activity. 
and see that we are off to a good start with our new forum. It's just that easy.